Hello and welcome to this session. I'm Raghav and you can find all my work on my website automationstepbystep.com. In this session, we will see how we can do integration with Source Labs and Browser Stack. Until now, we have been running our test cases on an agent that we set up on a physical or a virtual machine. But in test project, we also have options to integrate with any of the cloud platforms like Source Labs and Browser Stack and we can run our test cases on these cloud platforms. So let's get started and I am on my test project dashboard. Now here you will find integrations. So go here to integrations and here you will find option for cloud execution. So I will go here and here you will find source labs and browser stack. I will go to source labs first and as I click here you can see I am getting a option to add my username and access key so that I can connect to my source lab account. Now in case you do not have an account you can just go to this sign up. So click here it will take you to sign up for source labs so you, so you can get a free account there and get a free trial for testing and you can then sign up and then get your username and access key. Now in my case I already have it so let me just sign into source labs and then I will get my username and access key and then provide it here. So my username is this and I will add my password and sign in to my account and here you can see here you can go to your account settings and then provide your username and access key in the fields below. So if I go here I will go to my user settings and here you can see I have my access key I will copy this access key and I will provide my username first for source labs and this is my access key and I will say save and you can see the integration is now enabled here. Same thing for browser stack I will click on browser stack and here again I have to provide the username and access key so I will again uh, sign in to my browser stack account again you can create a free account you can just sign up and create a free account for trial so here I have my account here again I will go to my profile and go to settings and here I will find my username so you can see for this we have different options here so app automate automate app live all these plans are here so this is my username I will copy this and provide it here and then the access key this is my access key I will provide this access key here and then say save and this should enable the integration with browser stack so now both of these integrations are enabled we also have this settings here so if I can if I want to change anything I can just change it from here and now if I go to my project so I will go to my any of my project here and then I will go to any of the test cases so I have my test cases under the demo test folder and I will click on this run button here and here you can see if I now click on this drop down you can see we have this options for agents that I already have but now you will see we have options for source labs and browser stack as well I can click on source lab and here I can see all the options all different browsers and operating system combination that I can use and similarly for browser stack if I go to the job we have a job here and if I go to edit and say next here again I can set default browsers for execution so again you will find here we have source labs and browser stack and again you will see all these different options here for different browsers and operating system and if you select any of these and then run them you will see they will get executed here and you will find all your test executions their recordings logs everything on your source labs or browser stack account so this is how you can do integration with cloud platforms like source labs and browser stack i hope this session was very useful for you thank you for watching